eating? We can start eating now or what? Say hi. Hi. Hey, hey. welcome back to the channel. New setup for now. Um, <laughs> temporary setup. <laughs> temporary. Story time maybe in the future. <laughs> so, um, Burger King, Bear Talks. Okay, so we got mozzarella sticks. Oh my God. Chicken fries. We don't have everything that America has, so, you know. Bear with us? Yeah. yeah. I wanted those red things, those hot Cheetos. They have hot Cheetos. Mm -hmm. Like, oh my god, those chicken so fingers. Yeah, so. Yeah. Mozzarella sticks. Yeah. We got the new crispy chicken. chicken. I know you're excited. Crispy chicken. Whopper. Walker. <laughs> Whopper. Chicken nuggets. Chicken nuggets. They have onion rings there, right? You guys can get it? Fuck. Yeah. It's my favorite. How could I be so stupid? Stacker. That's my favorite. Another chicken. Crispy sandwich, Original, regular, that's the one I like. and then I want to try these. Whoops. Oh. <laughs> Oreo, <laughs> Oreo, and Hershey's Sunday and Oreo cheesecake. Wow, you really Same got water? Healthy, yeah. healthy. She, she really said water. With, I like it. Like chest, she was her chest. She said, "Yeah, yeah." I really did not expect that. Can I have that? Yeah, you have your own. It's over there. That was Shoshana's, and she left it over there. So. I know. Chicken poulet. Okay, wait. Chicken. Is this the crispy chicken? Yeah. Do you say chicken poulet? <laughs> so, sorry, okay. I actually never eat Burger King. Burger King, like as a kid, even yeah. I never had Burger King. Like this that. is not that appetizing. I feel these are very like mm -hmm. sub. I grew up near a Burger King, so like I'd eat this after school and stuff, like mm. on Whopper Wednesdays with my friends. Mm. Mm. Is it good? I just love yeah. it. Really? Mm-hmm. I've heard other people say the stacker is really good. Sorry, there's a stacker sauce in it. And it's just mm. so tangy and good. Do you want to try it? Mm. Mm. I want chicken. Oh. I saw David Dobrik eating this. Wow, he has so much Crispy money. chicken? What is that? Yeah, he doesn't need to eat this. No, he <laughs> ate two of these in two seconds on Trisha Paytas' thing. He put bare ranch, but they don't have ranch sauce. Hmm? Mm hmm Lame. Mm. It was so good. I was watching him and I was like, wow, that tastes so good. I gotta taste it. Chicken nuggets. Mm -hmm. I'm genuinely hungry, so I think today we're actually gonna finish the food. Maybe. No, no actually, might. maybe, like, actually. Mmm. What is that? The crispy chicken kind of hot Mmm. Because it looks like real chicken. I love when it, the chicken does this, like the full part. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. No, it's like real chicken. chicken. Yeah. yeah. That's good, fam. Mm -hmm. That's really good. There's another one. Mm. I don't know why. This Burger King tastes especially good today. Really good. It's mm. fresh. It's because we always eat it from the cold today. Mmm. Mm, right. It has a piece of heat to it. Mmm. <laughs> that is a delicious sauce. I was watching Veronica Wang. What's her name? Jolly Bee, right? No, not Jolly Bee. When she, you know she's in Toronto now. Yeah. She made like these really extra long pastas. And oh my god, it looks so good. But she's um, always cooking. And she's um, always eating. Mm -hmm. You know what's crazy? The mozzarella sticks and the chicken fries taste the same. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Are they good? Mmm. Not really. She loves them. They do taste like the cheese. Like, <laughs> they taste like a cheese, cheese not like... chicken. Mm. Enjoy mm -hmm. this. I can't believe I didn't eat anything all day today. Just for this, you know. Really? Because I knew if I ate, because it was like pretty late, mm -hmm. then I would be full. Their nuggets were always really good to me. It's just that um, Wednesday they said 10 nuggets for $1.99. And then mm -hmm. I got back. And then I said, oh, what's going on? <laughs> like, you know, why are you guys doing that? Mm. These are the worst. What, what do you mean? Chicken nuggets? They're so good. You know what's really good? You know, you guys have the Jane's, the mm -hmm. Jane's chicken nuggets? See, the thing is, I look like Shoshana because only lazy people. <laughs> you don't know what James is? The ones you make at home? Yeah. Oh, yeah, they're good too. The James one? The chicken too? Yeah. Up. yeah. <laughs> if I had those in my house, I was set. My favorite. Those are really good too. You mm -hmm. don't like these? They're good. I've had better. Mm -hmm. Wendy's is better. Mm -hmm. Wendy's is the best. Mm -hmm. But these are better than McDonald's. I, I love McDonald's. McDonald's chicken, chicken nuggets is so, so good. good. Like, it tastes like the biggest chicken thing. No, no, no. no. It's, there's some that's one of the chickens, like chicken things that tastes good, like tastes mm. real. What? Yeah. I mean, nothing tastes real, but like I get what you mean. The junior chicken is crazy because that's so good. <laughs> huh? Junior chicken is so good. It's so good, but like if you think about it, it's like it's the worst at the same time. Why? Mm. I don't know. I like. I don't like the chicken part. Like you know. What? what? That's the best part. This is so yeah. seasoned. Can I try some of this cheesecake already? I love sweet and like changing. Do you want to finish all your meat first? No, it's okay. Anyways, I'm mm. trying the Oreo cheesecake. Is it good? Is it mm -hmm. water here? Let me have it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're <laughs> sugar. Sure. The way when I said it, it was good, her eyes lit up. There's the a lot of things in there. so much memory to me, though. Mm-hmm. Like, summertime. summertime. Yeah. 
Summertime when I was a kid. I like sesame seed bun, so I, like, I really like that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. We used to terrorize Burger King by my school, like my middle school, because we used to be right by there. <clears throat> really? Yeah. Oh, no, your school was good. My school was good. I don't know. Yeah. Every time you talk about, like, these bad stories, I'm like, we went to Because you went to... <laughs> <laughs> we were really, really good. Yeah. Finished my stacker. Now what should I eat? Wow, really? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, guys, trying the Oreo desserts. What is that called? Oreo cheesecake? Oreo cheesecake. Hot fuck. What are you talking to? We need to do a cheesecake factory with them. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, Dolly What? She's, she's a fan of Oreo anything, though. Guys? It's good. It's good. Here. I don't really want dessert right now. Me neither. I'm gonna wait. Okay. It's weird that mm -hmm. you're mixing it. I love mixing sweet stuff with my food. Is that gross? No. I like doing it, too, but that, like, I don't know. That's kind of weird. Do you like cheesecake? Uh-huh. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Why am I enjoying myself so much right now? We got distracted, but we were supposed to talk about independence and leaving your nest. What do you Finally think about that? Nest. Yeah, tell me. Is, Is there like a, um, like an age that you should be when I you decide know. to move out? No, I don't think so. But I do think that like it's never going to be like, if you're like, if you're not graduated and have a real job, it's never going to be the right time for you. Yeah. You'll never feel like, damn, I can do this mm -hmm. confidently. Unless you have, like, a side hustle or, like, a really good... Fair savings? Mm -hmm. Yeah, a really good, like... Not even career. Even non traditional so. career. What do you mean? Like, say if you're, like, a YouTuber. Because you just have, like, a degree. But, like, if you're doing other things and you have a lot of money... Just, like, if you're, like, financially stable. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm saying, like, if you're mm -hmm. young and you're trying to just do things on your own, it's always yeah. going to be hard for you. But, like, people do it all the time. Like, mm -hmm. all the time people, mm -hmm. like leave at 18 and they That's figure crazy. things yeah. out you know i can't imagine being 18 and moving yeah, out yeah i was so stupid fucking dying Let me check if there's stop stop what i'm not looking at your feet i know what you're doing the thing is just so like um you got a pedicure even shana remember what you sent the, us the thing where you sent yourself the thing five years ago like in high school oh yeah and you're like oh, hopefully you're i moved yeah. out by this age and it's like 22. even i would thought like that and it's like that's hilarious. Nah. Like, you know, like, <laughs> that's funny. That's so cute. <laughs> when you're in high school, you think, like, in your 20s, you years. have life figured out. Mm. Yeah. Like, no. Yeah. Shit happens, guys. Yeah. Things are I mean, there time. are people who are, like, set with their life and they know what's up. Yeah. But there's a lot of people But it that is don't still so really like, rare to move out early 20s. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, not, yeah, comfortably. Mm -hmm. On your own, not with roommates and stuff. Mm -hmm. I'm like, ideally, it's to. Buy your first property, not rent. You know, renting mm -hmm. is like, you know? But I do think that when you have, like, parents that provided for you all your life and did all the work for you, you don't know how to work hard. And mm -hmm. a lot of kids don't know how to save their money. Mm -hmm. And, you know, it's like, but it's so important that when you're in your 20s to have money in your bank account. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, for a rainy day, for anything, you know? Mm -hmm. You have to be able to... People, like, when they're young, they think, oh, I'll, I'll just save later on. Like, yeah. When I'm, when I'm older. Right mm -hmm. now, I can just, like, you know... Spend recklessly, but no. You should save every, um, like a portion of every paycheck that you get. Mm. And from when you're young, bro, all of our yeah. young viewers. From when you're mm. young, if you save up until you're like 25, you'll be so sad. Yeah. Mm. And you'll be so happy with yourself. Mm -hmm. And even if you have nothing to like make the purchase towards, like you will have something in the future. Mm -hmm. And to have that money already set aside for you. Yeah. It's, it's so be, good. Yeah. It's such a brain. fulfilling like feeling. But yeah, we're in the process. Apartment hunting. It's really fun. It is really fun. I love it. Yeah. We literally got catfished because mm -hmm. on... Um, Story on, time. Yeah. <laughs> but, okay, so we're not going to tell you the site we use, but, like, they displayed nice Sorry. pictures of the apartment. It's a not, condo. It was a beautiful, nice condo. Like, one of those, like, low-rise, cute condos, like, you know, that have the, you can think that are bigger. But this was a nice condo. Ones. And then the inside was, like, hardwood, nice <clears throat> floors, not, like, those square hard floors, mm -hmm. you know? Um, nice, like, decent kitchen, like, granite still, and, like, two it's decent side bedrooms, and then a big bathroom. Fam. When we get there, <laughs> the guys <laughs> will take off our shoes. No, 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 first, Wait, what? first, there's two buildings, they're, like, these low-rise, they look like, I, like, really beat ass, like, they look like, just, like, far from the picture, like, yeah, really not up to par and all. we're like checking the address like is it it and then <laughs> we're like, we were we were so yeah. disappointed we're like no and then remember it? that guy outside mm -hmm. so i'm like 
he waved at us and I'm like, are you like meeting us? And then I told him, I'm like, this does not look like the picture. Like from far, I'm saying, this is not what I look like on the picture, right? Mm. And he's like, he's like, oh, it's not me. You're not meeting up with me. If you want a one bedroom, let me know. And then he like walked right past us. And then the next place, like the other building was right beside it, but we went to the wrong one. Mm -hmm. And then, um, so he waved at us and we went. It was like a three story mm -hmm. walk up, mm -hmm. which is not what the picture said either. Mm -hmm. So then. We walk up the stairs. It smelled really bad in the building. Mm. It smelled as like cologne, as entered, bro. It smelled, as soon as we entered, it, it smelled like they just tried to cover up, like, oh. the, the body odor smell that it originally had. It just smelled like that. So when we went so up to gross. the apartment, when we went up to the condo, he made us take off our shoes. Um, he like, hit off our shoes like, what? what? <laughs> like, we, we never had to do this before. This is really weird. And then we went inside, and it smelled even worse. Like, there was a rotting smell. Did you have to tell them? That there was a whole dead squirrel outside. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you didn't tell a me that. A whole dead opened up squirrel outside. Outside the door. Hmm? They couldn't wait, 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 wait. Outside the door? Yeah. Outside the door. Mm -hmm. Of the building. Of the building, yeah. Yeah, what? Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. we go inside and then I'm like, um, sir, this is not at all what the picture said. And he's, and he's like, like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> What? And we're like, let's get the fuck out of here. Like, what the fuck? We put our shoes on and literally mm -hmm. ran out. Like, we, we told them, we're like, you shouldn't do that. Like, you're wasting people's time. What the hell? One day somebody's gonna get actually fight you. Mm -hmm. Like, somebody? you wasted their time to look at this shitty ass apartment. Like, yeah, like, we're imagine so mad. somebody drove far. I know. Luckily, it wasn't that far from where we live, so mm -hmm. it wasn't that bad. But, like, if we had driven a, a long way to Dude see that, yeah. yeah. I'm gonna be like, this, mm -hmm. this little man really, yeah. really pissed me off today. Like, she that could ruin my day. Even yeah, really got the one about the the hoarder. She's talking about the hoarding one. Oh my oh god! Oh my god! <laughs> How did you guys oh get finesse this my god. in one no, day? No, that wasn't oh. a finesse. That wasn't that wasn't the landlord's fault. That's like their dirty ass yeah, the tenants. Oh, sorry. They were so disgusting. Okay, so <laughs> we've been apartment hunting for like the past two weeks. It was the first apartment we saw, right? Yeah. That started out our um, apartment hunting. So what was it the first one? Yeah. No. Was it? Yeah, it was. Remember? She's like, I'll show you this one, then we went upstairs. Mm. And we're like, oh, this is nice. Really cute area. Great area. Cute, you know, lobby. Like, everything was looking good. The place itself was nice. Like, the actual uh, suite that we saw. Oh, my God. Was, was nice. Sorry, guys, we're having a little technical difficulties. Oh, oh my God. God. Okay, it was nice on the outside. It was nice on the inside, too. Like, everything was newly renovated. Mm -hmm. um, the layout of the place was really nice. It's just when we went inside, you know the TLC show hoarders? <laughs> like, I have a hoarding addiction? Oh. No. This girl, this family... It was not a family. It was three female students. Oh, it was... Oh, oh. it wasn't... Were they young? Yeah, students. Oh, no. Why are they being nasty? Not saying anything about people in Saskatchewan. But, saying. guys... There were there were dirty dishes on the oh. island, on the sink. When we when we first came in, it smelled like um, cat piss. Cat piss. When you open the door, like the <clears throat> floor, like when you open it, it's like you open like like you're moving all the garbage with the door. Like it it's was so, so gross. disgusting. Why did I tell them also that the landlord the lady had a key? <laughs> she was like that. People were still in the apartment. Like usually, what landlords she was sleeping do, right in front of us. What landlords do usually is like they give the tenants like 24 hour notice. Okay, I'm gonna be in your apartment. So if you guys gotta clean up, whatever, I'm showing off the apartment. You know, no notice. She literally just put her key in, opened it, like opened all the garbage, and we walk in in this place like garbage all over the floor. Old Uber bags, like McDonald's Uber bags, Uber all over the floor. Gross. Like apples in the floor, like all dirty. Like basically, like as if like. This was like their entire their floor. Place. Like literally, like as if they yeah. had like 500 mukbangs in their apartment <laughs> and never cleaned up afterwards. The kitchen has a nice little island. It's a nice kitchen. But the entire thing was like covered in dishes, like mm -hmm. stacked. Like it was really, really disgusting. And every mattress, like every floor had a mattress this thin on it. Yeah, <laughs> this girl funny. was knocked out, knocked out dead. I'm not sure. But I don't know what her She did not wake was. up though. Like we did the whole tour and there she was three, still sleeping. Three girls. Oh, and then we went, yeah. yeah. <laughs> we walked in there. Still sleeping. She did not wake up. Or maybe she was embarrassed and just pretended to sleep. I would. Yeah, I would. I would. <laughs> I would put my covers up. and like just like, oh, you guys really came, huh? Yeah. Yeah. There's no way I'm 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 facing somebody mm -hmm. when you really realize I live in filth. Yeah. 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 Like that was like filth. Like that. Like if my mom saw that. She would beat them up. <laughs> I don't know. Are yeah. you guys ready to live uh, non frivolously? Oh Having God. to live within your means. I think I think what's 
school needs to teach you guys is fucking saving your money and the import- importance of yeah. money. But obviously importance they're not teaching us that on your, purpose. Um, of <laughs> good credit yep. as well. Yeah. You guys don't think this is on purpose? What? Not. That Maybe. schools don't teach us that? Because they don't want everybody to be good with their money. They don't. This is how the world works. They want to keep some of us down. Okay. <laughs> okay. I'm not being dead ass. Like, why wouldn't they? After all these kids, like, gen- we're not the first generation of kids who've been like, wow, yeah. I wish I learned this earlier. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So many people, but they don't include that in the curriculum. They definitely should. Okay. Is that like a conspiracy theory? Yes. Yours? I mean, if you took it's business true, classes, though. when I took business classes in high school, they had that. We had like a report where you had to like, if you have this much money, how much money should you allocate to this? Like rent, food, da da da. But like, it's just again, like it's grade twelve. But, yeah, that's it's grade not, twelve, and yeah, it's like, it's not, not everyone like, takes it. Yeah, it's an elective. It's yeah. not like something you yeah, have to Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, it's very like you have to search for it type yeah. of thing. It's not crazy that like you can what, be homeless. What? That scares me. Like, no, that's I think, homeless- sorry, sorry, sorry. I don't mean to like interrupt you, but yo. When I see homeless people, I say, that could be me. Like, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. it could be anybody. Like, anybody yeah. can be homeless. You know what I mean? Like, I never think to someone, like, oh, like, you know, like, you put yourself here or something like yeah. that. I just think, like, it could be any anybody. Yeah. Like, things can happen in your life that go out of your control, yeah. and you can end up homeless. So like, scary. especially if, like, a lot of things happen to you all at, at once. Same like, time? let's say, like, all your family, like, passes away, or, yeah. and then you're uh, financially you're, unstable, yeah. and then you're, like, mentally not, like, stable because you're, like, you don't have your family, like, starting all drugs. These, Yeah. All these things get in the wrong ple- people, Crab. and then it just like snowballs, <laughs> snowballs. snowballs. Yeah. yeah, like you know, and then you end up on the street. Mm. Like you never know what can happen to you. So mm. guys, save your freaking money. Oh, I was gonna say, isn't it crazy that we're like we're not at the age, but we're close. We're creeping towards the age of like people like getting married and having kids, mm-hmm. and it's like uh, I actually never think about that. Like it's crazy. Like I, I that never all the think. Low key, I'm like, wow. Soon my friends are gonna get married. Soon I'm gonna attend a wedding of my friends. Like that's what I think. Of. No, I know, but like I'm saying for me personally, like I, I kids, child, what? Okay, yeah, like that. Kids, no, but like marriage. And, I don't like, even like paying the full bus fare. Like you know what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah. like I'm, that's where I am. In I life. still don't. If I'm ever on the bus, like the last time I took the bus, I two dollars. Three quarters. Even a dime. <laughs> yeah, yeah, a dime as a token, like you know. A to- yeah. No, but like. I get scared because I because now I work downtown and I always take the streetcar mm-hmm. and like I actually can't. Streetcar is bad. Like, yeah, they have the people waiting. They have the people. I realized. I said, yeah. let me stop. I know. <laughs> let they me asked stop. me one time. Mm-hmm. I said, oh, I can't. Yeah, past. yeah. Because in Toronto, guys, like the way the streetcar is set up, like if you're not from here, you would think, oh, I don't have to pay. Free, yeah, because yeah, mm-hmm. the doors just open for you on the street, so it's like nobody's gonna check. Nobody's gonna ask me for money. And then the fare inspector comes and I yeah. get out five hundred dollars. I yeah. need to stop. <laughs> I need to stop. I tap my debit card where they, the, you know, the, the, the presto? Presto? And it's so funny because people look at me like, <laughs> it, it didn't make the noise. <laughs> I <laughs> know, you know. No, you know no. why? Because I, like, I always go places Sorry, after work and I refuse to pay. Like, I'm yeah. just so, like, it's crazy how, like, my mind, like, if I have money and I don't have to, like, use it, like, I'm not going to use yeah. it. But I, I stopped doing that. Cause I'm, Are you sure? Yeah, no, I stopped because I'm, like, I felt one day that, like, it's, they're going to come, like, Ooh, it's just, they like, will. It's, yeah. like, it's just a matter of time. Because what they do is, once you get to the station, no, even they're now, waiting at the door. You yeah. know? When now you they're not at the station no more. So yeah. now so they get on. No, 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 they get on. They get on. Oh, shit. They get on the streetcar. The TCC fair inspectors, no like, way. get on a, oh, ra- no, I've seen that. I've seen like that a, a random stop. And they look like police low key. Oh yeah, it's like, really <laughs> scary. And I'm, I just can't, like, like I, I used to think, I was like, why is the police on that? I was like, yo, there's something going mm-hmm. on. But now I realize it's just And I can't be caged in, in public. I'm so sorry about it. I'll cry. I'll cry. <laughs> I'll, I'll cry. I'll, then I'll take an Uber home and yeah. I'm sad. Because <laughs> yeah. then they can't punk you yeah. and you have no money. Yeah. So take a whole Uber home. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever, I'm going to call an Uber, anyways. Yo, people, whenever they get fined here, they give a false name. Yeah. So you have to always have your alias. Yeah. Paul, Paul did that. He got caught by the um, TTC police, and then he gave them <laughs> <laughs> so stupid, like, whatever TTC transit inspectors. Mm-hmm. But um, he gave them a fake name, fake postal code, and they're like repeat it. <gasps> yeah, and then he just ran into the train. <laughs> he ran into the train and it went. They followed him upstairs. He just ran. Like oh all you have to, all you have to do is use your postal code, but use just switch one yeah, letter. Yeah, one letter. That way you'll remember mm-hmm. it. Like, I would repeat it up and be like, LP two three five six. Yeah, because yeah, they like he so many chased. people did that. Yeah, that is. And scary. then he got it right Literally. when it closed. This is a movie. I will never like. Knock anyone for like trying to finesse the TTC. Mm-hmm. Like, that's just life. Because every yeah. day they want to say 10 has. more cents, 15 yeah. more cents. No. no way. $2 for life, bro. Right? Mm-hmm. Like, what, what am I doing spending $12 <laughs> on 
bus fare the whole day. That's kind of crazy. Yeah. Going like multiple places. Oh, yeah. And if you want to take the go or something, mm-hmm. like, no way. Okay, buy but the go, the point. go, you actually have to buy the ticket. We're playing games with that one. No, no, no. I never buy the ticket. <laughs> Bro, every time I'm, I'm on the go I, and I don't buy a ticket and I get asked, because it's not like I never get like, and I get lucky. No, they ask me and I'm like, really? Oh my God. Yes, they ask me and I'm like, oh my God, I think I threw it out thinking it was the receipt. And that works every time. Really? And I give them like the most like serious. I'm, like, I'm so sorry. Oh my God. And they're like, how much is it? Guys, it's 565. It's 565. <laughs> remember the thing? Because they just like test you because if you say yeah. like four or something or mm-hmm. and they're like, um, no, it's like you would have known. Mm-hmm. And but they yes. Finesse. And then they finesse. But it's that, that's not going to last forever. Like yeah. that. Yeah. That one, one day he's going to say, no, that's what you said last time. <laughs> I just done. can't be punked. Like, you know what I mean? Like, like uh, as long as I, as long as it's just mean that knows that I didn't pay, like, other people can't know that I didn't pay. Like, nah, that's not going to work. I don't like when you didn't, you don't tell me that you didn't finesse. Like, you know, you have to tell me you're not paying because I can't be with you. It's my sister. I can't be with you and you get called and I actually came, was like, excuse yeah. me, she paid. Like, mm-hmm. she put 10 cents in and she asked for a transfer. I said, that's not how that works. <laughs> Like, but, I, but I low key always do that too. Like I ask them to distract them from what I was saying. Oh, I mean, true, what I'm putting. Like true. I put it up. They like, can have a transfer, and they look up. You yeah. know, she's yeah. smart. No, but and she wanted. She just wanted. Talk- she wanted oh. a transfer. Like, she dropped the ten cents. We walked a little bit, oh, and, and, she then, and she went back, and she got a transfer. And then I, said, I was about to go. Like then, and she was like, sit down. She was like, she was like, she was like, because I was about to be like, I thought she paid. There's no way. Like I just didn't think. <laughs> you know she didn't pay like just paid the two dollars yeah and then after that um she dropped you know she did she dropped one dollar and then he gave her a transfer oh. yeah. so so a dollar so, so the, okay, still uh, safe yeah. yeah okay guys we hope you enjoy our um burger king mukbang um let us know of any what is it public transport finessing stories that you guys had if you guys mm-hmm. ever got caught let us know and let us know um how you guys save your money like what Techniques do, do you yeah. Need? Are there apps? Like, what do you do? Like, let us know. Help us because mm-hmm. our lives are about to change very soon. So, yep. yep. Hope Bye. you guys enjoyed this. Oh. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed this. Subscribe to her channel. Don't know when she'll she, post. If she posts, we're not sure. Maybe you shouldn't subscribe to her channel. I'm gonna post. Just subscribe. Mm-hmm. Yeah, okay. Okay. Bye. Anyways, bye. Oh, subscribe to our channel too, though. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Bye.